Good afternoon, Arthur. Uh, thank you for coming today. And uh, first, um, may I take this opportunity to congratulate you on your uh, appointment, your reappointment as the uh, Study Group 9 Chairman. Well, thank you, Toby. I'm uh, glad to have another four years to work in this exciting area. Very good. And, and, and perhaps you could tell us a little bit about some of the achievements uh, in, the, in the last study period between 2009 and now, 2012, Study Group 9. Okay. Well, in the last four years, we have worked on a large number of areas, uh, all in the uh, broadband cable television industry. Uh, one, one big high... Uh, high-profile area well, is IPTV over cable. Now, we work uh, with Study Group 13 and Study Group 16 on those because they, they are also working in, in those areas. Another area is quality assessment of video and multimedia. That's both uh, objective and subjective methods. We've just gotten into uh, assessment of 3D TV, which is a very hot topic. And then we have uh, traditional areas such as transmission, worked on transmission of large screen digital imagery, uh, some of the uh, ultra high definition as well as standard and high definition television. I, I understand that another uh, new feature in the work of Study Group 9 in the last period was uh, smart cable. Right, just in the last uh, meeting of Study Group 9 in May, we established a focus group, a uh, focus group on smart cable television. And it's uh, very exciting. Uh, they've met three times already. They're meeting again actually next week in, uh, in Shanghai. And they're, they're investigating all the, the, new, the newest areas in uh, cable television. And uh, I'll tell you more about that uh, in a few minutes because uh, that just got started and that's sort of in the future area. Uh, so are there any other areas of work that you'd like to highlight from the, from the previous period? From the previous period I'd like to highlight uh, an important set of recommendations on preferential telecommun telecommunications which uh, allows for services such as emergency telecommunications to have priority access during times of disaster, and uh, that's, that can be very important, and uh, we're proud of that work. Also, there's the, the, the work on uh, set-top boxes and home networking that, uh, that has carried on and will carry on into the future. And maybe I should move into the, to the next study period. Please do. The, uh, I, I think the most important aspect uh, or the most exciting aspect, it's hard to say which is most important, but the most exciting is the smart cable television. In that area, we're, we're developing, well, we're, we're looking now, but we plan to develop recommendations for uh, like grocery shopping over the cable network. So, uh, so a customer can browse, shop for their groceries, and have them delivered. There's, there's uh, health aspects, we've been talking at the WTSA about e-health. There's, uh, there's systems to share patient data through the cloud, but using cable networks in the home to do that. And uh, these, these two items will help with uh, accessibility, which is a very big topic these days. Other areas uh, with, home, with uh, smart cable television will be using uh, watching television on mobile devices that are, are harmonized with their cable set-top boxes. So a person could be watching a television show in their, in their living room and then just walk, walk outside and keep watching it on their uh, smartphone. So there's really quite a bit of interesting stuff. We will continue to work on our traditional areas of transmission. A new transmission system called HiNOC is just started work. It's a, uh, a high, I guess it's a high efficiency transmission system that will be able to deliver television, our normal television, as well as internet, uh, and, you know, over, over a faster network. That's called HiNOC. 
Then we will continue to work on quality assessment, which uh, will we'll go into the areas, more into the areas of 3D TV, subjective and objective methods, and, uh, and move into areas such as uh, ultra high definition TV. There's two, vers two flavors of that, 4K and 8K. We're already working on the transmission over cable networks in one question, and we'll begin to work on the, assessing the quality in our assessment questions. This is all very enlightening. There's a lot of this new work that I, I didn't know about, and I'm very much looking forward to uh, reporting on that uh, as we move forward. Um, thank you very much for your time this afternoon. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Arthur.